My Poker Degens, what is happening? So tonight we made a big mistake. Um, fortunately, it worked out in our favor, to our advantage, but we clicked away from the sign-in page and came back, and what we thought was a six-man double-up $50 turbo was a six-man hyper tournament, and it wasn't a double-up. We played all the way to one winner. So fortunately, um, at least top two positions get paid out. So I didn't realize that till there was three players left and the game was still going on. So spoiler, spoiler alert, we at least make top three. Uh, but I was a little confused when we got to three players and the game wasn't over. So um, the reason I'm afraid to play these regular tournaments where it gets to heads up is because there's a lot of computer software that could give a lot better aid to heads up play. So that's what's fortunate about these triple ups, these nine man triple up tournaments is that once it gets down to three people, the game's done. It's hard to use software um, to help you as easily as it is in heads up. So anyway, uh, we do this $50 tournament and embarrassingly find out halfway through. But um, pretty pretty fast pace that's another thing i don't like about these hypers um it's it's high variance um you really don't get to be patient and wait on good cards if your car dead for like 10 minutes you're not looking good so to give you an example i mean we're 10 minute i mean not 10 minutes not even 10 hands into the tournament and people are already out there's two people already out so um we hadn't played one hand there's already two people out. Um, so anyways, we're gonna try and dodge these in the future, but it was fun to mix it up um, and it's pretty late. So now I can edit this video and still get to bed before 1 a.m. So enjoy the video, let's get some cards in the air. All right, we are five hands in. We have pocket tens in the big blind. One person's already out, one person's already down to 40. These hyper hyper tournaments are crazy fast all right uh, we take it down with pocket tens big blind special all right we got pocket sevens on the button uh, the small blind is already all in so we're just gonna call and hopefully we get a check from this guy and we'll just dominate this guy and get him out of the tournament here I'm okay with losing here if it takes this guy out. Oh, well, I'm glad we didn't take a stab at that. Homeboy flop three of a kind. Oh my gosh, it's just pocket, pocket pair nation. Uh, okay, we got pocket six in the cutoff. Uh, we're just gonna call here. We just need one more person to go out so we don't wanna get crazy. There it is, six in the window. It's a pretty easy call for us. Our opponent ships it. Five, nine. Looking good. We got ace king suited on the button and we just raise 100. Hopefully this guy goes all in, he's already half price. And this will be the end of the tournament, hopefully. There it is. We're gonna call five more. King nine. Just dodge a nine. That's all we gotta dodge. That's it. Fifty dollar double up. Oh, I guess this isn't a double up. This is just a hyper turbo. <laughs> I misread the description. Always know what game you're playing. That is very embarrassing. All right, so uh, if this tournament is what I think it is, then top two positions play pay. Um, all right, we are in position. We flop top pair here. 
with Jack 3, uh, Jack 9, 2, Rainbow Board. So we will be betting this. We're just going to bet pot 100. And we scoop. All right, we got ace two offsuit on the button. Um, I don't love this spot. We're gonna make a nitty fold here. All right, we're in the money after that hand. Glad we folded. We would have lost uh, whatever we raised. All right, we got a 10-9 offsuit in the big blind. And we are going to fold. Uh, I'm gonna call and then likely our opponent will jam because he seems uh, pretty loose. And then we'll call with ace-9. He elects to check and it is on him to act. This kind of crushes his preflop calling range. So we're going to check this back. Uh, three diamonds out there now. Seven, two, six, jack. Three diamonds. We're going to bet 100 here. Try and take this down. Queen of hearts on the river. I'm going to check this right here. I'm going to think about this. Let's think about this. We have time. We have 15 extra seconds. What did he call me with? A diamond, maybe? We're going to rip it all in. And we take it down. 5-8 suited. I like a call here. All right, we have a gut shot and there's two diamonds out there. If he had an ace, what would he do? All right, we're gonna eat some time here. Okay, we do have a double gutter now so we are going to call 150 we have lots of outs and we miss all of them our opponent bet 150 on the turn and then he checks he checks the river so we're going to bet for thin value as a bluff and hopefully we get our opponent to fold he knows that if he raises, I have to call. So it looks like a very good value bet. So that's why we bet that amount. Uh, we're just going to go all in with ace three suited here. King 10 suited. We have 960. We're in for 200. I don't like it. All right, queen five, small blind on the button. We're going to eat some time and think about this. Do we want to jam? I think we can pick up a better holding than this. Oh, we hit a five. Five is staying alive. Let's go. We had jack five versus jack six. Four eight suited. We're in for 150. We're gonna be the aggressor here. We're gonna raise it up to 600. Four eight takes it down. Jack eight suited, we're gonna call. There's an eight, there's a spade, 
There's a spade. Let's go. All right, we take command of that. Take command of this tournament. We're going to call if he jams. We're going to probably call him. Any two cards. Oh, eight. Oh. All right, jack three. We're calling. There's a jack. Let's go. No two. Come on. All right, so we still doubled up. We got second place and the cash prize was 105. So not bad. That six seven was a little wild, but um, it's any two cards at this point. Um, heads up is wild. All right, hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll do another one soon.